So I just want to talk just a couple more points on pride that I think that I missed that are very important. And uh, so I talked about kind of the opposite of pride or the right attitude that we need to have is humility to be humble before God, right? But I think that, that to go into it a little bit deeper, that humility includes thankfulness and gratefulness. And really that's the answer to a lot of these sins, these, the seven deadly sins, uh, is that we need to be thankful. Okay, because who are we to be prideful about anything in our lives? You know, what have we accomplished that God has not allowed us to accomplish? So we need to be thankful. Like Paul said, you know, give thanks in everything. In everything, give thanks. Always be thankful, right? We should always be constantly praising the Lord for his goodness and what he has done in our lives, for our salvation and all of our blessings. Okay, who are we to be prideful? So really, we get down to the root of the issue. I think that we need to be thankful. Okay, um, now if we think about our, our accomplishments, our achievements, you know, we need to praise God for those things. Okay, it's nothing that we did, you know, completely of ourselves. Um, and, you know, so there are lots of things that people get prideful about, you know, um, you know, their job, their wife, their children, their house, their car, their ability, you know, um, you know their athletic ability or their musical ability or talent or whatever you know people get prideful about all kinds of stuff and uh in the end it's we only have those things because god allowed us to have us so thank you god praise god we need to be grateful okay um like i said that's the answer to other things too because i'll talk about covetousness and how we need to be content with the things that we have but really we need to be thankful for the things that we have as well so it comes down to, you know, are we thankful for these things that the Lord has given us? We need to constantly be thankful. You know, when I was talking about how I think about these things in my head, how I belittle other people and stuff, it's almost as if if that person came here right now and I was face to face with that person, I would put them in their place because, you know, I would say, you know, you are nothing. Look at all the things that I have done and I would just put them down, you know, and that's a totally wrong attitude. That is pride talking. Okay, that is sin, uh, you know. So I just want to say that we need to be constantly thankful and grateful and praising the Lord. And that's, that's really what we need to, you know, we need to examine ourselves and see that, you know, are we being thankful enough? Be thankful for everything, for the air that we breathe, for the clothes that we have, for the house that we live in, for the bed that we sleep on. Okay, every little thing we should be thankful for. And I used to just do that, and I haven't even done that recently, but, you know, I, I would wake up every morning and pray and thank God for all those things. You know, I need to get back into doing that. But, you know, that's one way to constantly stay humble. You know, right off in the bat in the morning, just get up and just say, thanks, God, thank you for everything that I have, you know, and get detailed about it, you know, so you, so you know in your head, you know, start thinking about the things that you need to be thankful for, every little thing, okay? Uh, so, anyways... Remember that. Be thankful, be grateful, praise the Lord. Uh, God bless. Except ye be converted and become as little children, ye shall not enter into the kingdom of heaven.